Many of us are wearing many different styled masks, but which one is best? News 2's Danielle Hensley spoke with a medical expert to find out. The Center for Disease Control and Prevention recommend cloth masks to save medical grade masks for health care. But experts say anything is better than nothing. A cloth face mask and blue surgical mask do the same thing, according to Dr. Melissa Ellis Yerian with Roper St. Francis. These do the same thing. The point of a surgical face mask or a cloth face mask is to contain your own respiratory droplets. The masks do not block the tiny particles that you could inhale with the coronavirus, but they do protect those around you. The way universal masking works, the key to that is the word universal. Everyone has to wear it in order for it to work because that means everyone's containing their own respiratory droplets and not infecting each other. An N95 non-medical mask is commonly used for industrial purposes and does keep you from breathing in tiny respiratory particles. So if you're wearing this, it's fine, but you need to cover this little, this valve, <laughs> this vent here with either some tape or some cloth because otherwise, while you're protecting yourself with what you're breathing in, you're exhaling your respiratory droplets and that would defeat the purpose of universal masking. A cloth face mask should have two layers according to CDC guidelines and be washed on a regular basis. A mask should fit snugly but comfortably and cover the nose and mouth with no gaping under the chin or on the sides. In Charleston, Danielle Hensley, count on two. Next on News 2. Tonight, we are speaking with the mayor of the city of Charleston, John Tecklenburg. Mayor Tecklenburg is live in our studio right now. We are continuing our conversation with him, talking about what the city of Charleston is doing to make sure that you and your family are safe. That conversation right after the break.